Hey guys, welcome back to another video today, and today we're going to be reviewing Season 8 of Jailbreak, and especially if the rewards are worth it. As you can see by the very top, I am extremely close to reaching level 7, which means I have pretty much all the rewards so I can show off to you guys and all that good stuff. So yeah, before we jump right into it, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe because it took me quite a little bit to grind all the way here, so it really helped me a lot. Anyway, let's go ahead and just jump right into the video. So first of all, as you can see, I have to pit maneuver three criminals and also call a cargo plane, so that's going to be a little bit of a fun job to do. So first thing first is probably pit maneuver some criminals. I mean, I already see one right over here. It's three different ones. Hello there. I'm just going to use a little bit of rocket fuel. Okay, I don't know if I can catch up to you. I literally have a Camaro. Alright, now I spawn in the Brulee. I'll be catching up to you, Torpedo. Come back here. Yep, I see the Torpedo. I don't even know what happened right there. They, I think someone just got flung right there. Yep, we just caught back up to the Roadster. Actually, not the Torpedo. I, I think I just completely misspoke. And, oh, they're trying to do the racetrack. Oh, they just juked me off right there. Come on, I just need a pit maneuver you. That's all I need to do. Just a little small pit maneuver. Come on, man. All right, so I just pit maneuvered somebody. All right, there you go. There's one person pit maneuvered. They got the MCL 36. All right, here we go. All right, we're catching up. I mean, the Brulee's the fastest vehicle, so here we go. That should count as pit maneuver. And is that two? Okay, that's one. Yeah, it's three different ones. All right, all right. I'll see you later. I just need one pit maneuver from you. Thank you very much. And come on, who's up? Who wants Mon? Okay, we got some fighting over here, so let's go ahead and get you really quickly. There you go. And also... Let's go get this person. Come on over here. Don't go yet. No, 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 no. There we go. All right. Yep, everybody got arrested here. That's cool, man. Okay, someone just started a donut shop robbery, so that's really good for us. Please don't crash into me. Thank you very much. And never mind. They're in a vault bike. We can't pip them over a vault bike. Come on. Never mind. This person literally, I don't know how their tires went out. There we go. We got him. <laughs> We actually got him. I don't know how they- I think there was a spike trap right there or something. Alright, cool, man. Oh, actually, I remember Volt Bikes can actually get pit maneuvered. I'm pretty sure that that's a thing now. Whoops. <laughs> yep, I just checked. Volt Bikes can be pit maneuvered. I, I completely forgot that was a thing. Yeah, Volt Bikes can be pit maneuvered. I, I, I forgot about that. Alright, so I'm at the prison, and this is like the best place to actually, you know, do contracts as people are trying to escape in their vehicles, right? So this person got the air tail. Come on. All right, luckily we're catching up. Please don't exit your vehicle. Please don't. I'm like right here. Okay. Oh, this person's in their vehicle now. Yes, 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 yes. And now it's time to pit maneuver you. There we go. I finished. And since for all your trouble, I'm going to arrest you because you just caused me some so much trouble. See you later. All right, so we're in a new game. I want to try to call the cargo plane, and I want a game that doesn't actually have the cargo plane in it, because last time, there was a cargo plane already called, because I saw a cargo plane already, like, up in the sky already. So, now we're going to head over to the airport and call in the cargo plane, and hopefully none of them spawns in right as I'm going to do it, because that's what happened last time. All right, so here we are. Let's go ahead and call the cargo plane. All right, here we go. And call boom. All right, we've reached level seven epic. All right, so this is level seven and I believe these are the ionized rims Yep, so right over here is the ionized rims and let's go ahead and three two one Redeem there we go. We've just gotten it the ionized rims and now let me go ahead and review all the seasonal rewards Because you know there's a quite a lot of stuff to reveal So let me actually use a different vehicle because the torpedo doesn't actually have spoilers on it So I actually want to use a different vehicle I think the Brulee actually fits pretty well because you can put spoilers on it So let's go ahead and show it off so first of all is level two and you get uh, the try on rims So let me go ahead and show you so rims and let's put on try on all right, so here it is. As you can see right over here, it's the Tryon rims. So let me go ahead and change the rim color. So this one, I believe, is a chrome. Yeah, let's go make it. Actually, chrome looks kind of decent, to be honest with y'all. Anyway, here's what it looks like on the road. As you can see, here's the Tryon rims. You know, let me just slow it down. As you can see, Tryon rims, that's level two. For level three, you actually get the circuit skin. So as you can see right over here, circuit board. This is what you get. You can take a little look at it. Circuit board, you know, pretty nice looking. So yeah, that's what you get for level three, the circuit gun skin. Now level four, this one, I have to say, arguably looks good on some vehicles and some other vehicles doesn't look exactly good on, but it is the overdrive spoiler. So over here, spoiler, and let's go ahead and try to find overdrive. As you can see, overdrive over here, and let's go change the spoiler color. I think cyan will look kind of good in it. Yeah, cyan. Let's actually try radiant ice. Does it glow? Yeah, it glows. Okay, there we go. So obviously, it doesn't really look good on the Brulee. You know, it's sort of oversized, right? So let's go ahead and spawn in the actual. The, so this is like the Bugatti Buron. So let's turn on the Bugatti Churon over here. As you can see, I think it looks good on the Churon. Yep, as you can see, it sort of fits there. 
Okay, I don't know about you, but it actually looks good over here if you look at the jailbreak, you know, tweet, the preview. Uh, but uh, this is what I got. Maybe I need to, like, change a little bit with the texture. All right, so I changed a little bit. So I got the armor texture and as well as, you know, a sort of light gray color. Um, but, yeah, I mean, there you go. This is how it looks like. I just say it looks good on some vehicles and some of the vehicles it doesn't look amazing in. So that's my thoughts on it. All right, so next up, we got the mecha arm spoiler for level four. Actually, I mean level five, actually, level five. So, all right, so spoiler, and let's go ahead and equip. There it is, a mecha arm. Check it out. So, yeah, this is what it looks like, as you can see. Mecha arm spoiler. This is what it looks like on the back. Really not much of a thought onto it. I mean, it looks okay. I mean, just a mecha arm spoiler. I mean, tell me what you guys think about it down in the comment section below. Really don't have much of an opinion on it. It, it looks cool. I mean, my favorite spoiler is obviously the JDM one, if you guys are wondering. So, moving on. All right, so this one is, I have to say, a bit overhyped, but it's still pretty cool. It is, of course, the Teleport Chambers, and I know a lot of y'all are actually excited about this, so let me go ahead and show you. But I feel it disappoints some of you guys, and some of you guys are like, yeah, it's fine. So let me go ahead and actually buy an apartment really quickly. So over here, let's go ahead and buy, and let's get in here, and let's close the door. But, you know, I'm just here just to show you guys, so let me go ahead, and this is where it is. So this is the Teleport Chamber, and um, yeah, you can't actually expand it. What I mean is, like, you can't actually, you know, let me actually place it down first. I think you can... Possibly, yeah, look at that. So I can possibly teleport uh, from one room to another room like that. There you go. I probably got to move this table over here. There you go, as you can see. And uh, it, it takes like one second to teleport over, as you can see. It takes one second to do so. So it's not teleporting instantly. Um, but another thing is you also can't like make this size. Like, I can't put this teleport chamber here and like put it all the way like back here or something. That does not work like that, unfortunately. Uh, but I think you can sort of make a good trap of it. I mean, someone have shown me a trap before. I, I, I don't know. You got to be creative with it. But you can't like extend the size of it or something or the range. But, you know, it, it's cool. It might disappoint some of you and it might be impressing some of you. I don't know. I'll tell me what you guys think about it down below. All right. And finally, for level seven, you get the ionized rims, which I told you in the beginning of this video. So let me go ahead and show you rims and let's find ionized. There's the ionized rims. I think it looks pretty cool as you can see right over here That's the ionized rims and yeah, that's about it for all I have right now But let me show you the other rewards. So for level 8 uh, is the circuit vehicle skin as you can see I think this will look pretty cool It's a nice skin to own and lastly you get the sci-fi kitchen for level 9 Which is you know the first kitchen item as apartments and of course here's the coolest part obviously the Celsior as you can see you get this one at level 10 and uh, if you are the top 2% of the entire season, you will get the energy rims. And of course, I was uh, very excited about that on February 1st, as you can see. But yeah, I think it'll take me about maybe next week. I should be getting the Celsius and reaching level 10. So yeah, so stay tuned for that video. It should come out next week. I don't know. It will really depends on how much XP I get. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Tell me what you guys think about the season rewards down in the comment section below. Do you think it's worth it or do you not think it's worth it what's your favorite season reward you know tell me down below i'd like to hear from you guys anyway thank you guys for watching and i'll catch you all later bye